Hi guys. So it's later in the day. I've already done one video, but I'm going to do a second one. Really because I'm a bit bored. It's Mother's Day still. And um, we've kind of done all the exciting bits. Sitting on the table was my latest bookishly. So I could be reading. But also, my mum on goose. And you know I love a bit of bling. <laughs> so, here we go. Every month I read my bookishly. Some of them I like, some of them I don't. Last month, if you remember, it was Pride and Prejudice. Which, you know, I enjoyed. But I think when you've read something quite a lot of times, you unconsciously, you skim a bit as you're reading. You know, you, so it wasn't gripping me finish it but it wasn't gripping me like some of the ones that I either haven't read for a very long long time or even haven't read at all so as you know with bookishly it's um tea in a book or coffee in a book I do tea in a book um I've got England's green and pleasant tea which is a luxury dried spearmint I can have that one and I love a mint tea especially if I've got a bit of an upset stomach I think mint tea is fabulous so Oh, I'm pleased with that. I'm just making sure there's nothing else in it. No caffeine, please. Heavenly cool, naturally dried spearmint is all that's in it. So, a tea I can have. And then, ah, I won't be a slave to the past. I'll love where I choose. The Mayor of Casterbridge. Ooh. <laughs> the Mayor of Casterbridge. Now, I think... I think I've read this back in the oh back in the so distant past but I may not have equally they've changed their art quite a bit this year I think there's been quite a change it's become very um simple very, almost plain plain's not the word but here we go so let's just have a quick look at the um synopsis and see have I read this or have I not? I, Mayor of Casterbridge. I think I have, but you know, so long ago that I couldn't tell you that much about it. But yes, by Thomas Hardy, of course. So this is my next read and once i finish doing this video this is what i'll be diving into because i won't need to edit this video straight away so i've got the bookmark and the book as i say the artwork is becoming it's a bit more sort of i don't know what you'd call that stylized rather than but i still like it you know it's still a heck of a lot nicer than the you know the <laughs> the classic novel that's inside which my husband tells me you can sort of print on demand these days he knows about printing books which i, I don't um but yes i'm really happy i'm really happy to read. i must have read it it's a thomas hardy i must have read it and i i'm pretty sure i have so anyway, that was my bookishly that and my um spearmint tea so happy then ooh, let's get a bit of bling on then it's mint velvet mint velvet <laughs> mint mongoose oh can you tell i've had a good day today tiring though having all the kids mum you know whole nine yards I mean, we only had fish and chips i mean i didn't have to cook anything don't get me wrong but it's just the noise and the and the just the, yeah just everything going on anyway mint mongoose you get a t-shirt with it it's a black one so let's See, I've been liking their t-shirts a lot so much so that I'm actually considering stopping my monthly tea club for a while because I'm beginning to get a little bit overrun with t-shirts and I don't want to stop the the um, mint mongoose ones because they're lovely oh I like that plain black with just this on the front and it says beauty in the process isn't that lovely <gasps> I am liking that a lot, a lot, a lot. Beauty in the process. And what are they? I mean, they're just sort of um, squiggly wigglies underneath it. I'm sure somebody would know what the artwork is about, but oh, I like it. Oh, I like it. I like it a lot. So um, yeah, very pleased with that. And then we get to the main event, which of course is the jewellery. Uh, yeah, beauty in the process. So our inspiration, here we go. 
Um, I was driving with my kiddos in the car the other day, the kind of drive without a specific destination in mind, but rather just a something to itch the craving of wanting to see a bit of the world. As we turned into a neighbourhood, these words came across the radio station we were rocking out to. Sometimes we ask God to help us grow, then we complain when it starts to rain. Ah, now you know that this is long. It's really interesting, really, really interesting. Helena does one every month that goes with the jewellery um, and what inspired the jewellery. Um, but it's about, you know, the path from point A to point B. So beauty in the process. So love it. Okay, love it. Let's have a look at the jewellery. As you know, beautiful envelope, always with this sort of wax seal on it open it up hello Ethel please don't knock the camera over Ethel's behind the camera she's been having a funny day today um I think this the windy weather I think has worn her out a little bit she spent most of the day either sleeping or chasing things she's sort of been a bit bipolar <laughs> I can't get into this ladies I'm having a heck of a job sorry at last I'm in I can't tell you what a wrestle that was but it goes to show you how well packaged it all is as usual i've got my little thank you card with yay it's here and of course my piece of uh werther's original candy Which is such a sweet idea oh one of the things has fallen out of the package oh first up is a ring now i wonder whether this could be a toe ring i was only thinking this the other day that we're getting round to that time of the year when toe rings are nice i was looking at my terrible toes and how they need painting I'm thinking, yeah, you know, back to the effort of the keeping your feet nice. But it's a beautiful ring. Can you see? As usual, here we go. What am I going to put it again? Here we go. I found a bit of black card. Can you see? It's got little holes in it. It's almost like infinity, but going on and on and on and on and on. And it's open so that you can adjust the size but that also sometimes means that they're really comfortable as toe rings and it's big i put it on my middle finger so i can show you i like that isn't that nice i'm going to try it on my toe a minute i won't show you because my toenails are looking terrible let me just try it on yeah it's too big it's too big for four of the little piggies and too small for the biggest piggy <laughs> so it is definitely intended for fingers i think I'm just, I'm stretching it slightly to see if it will go on the big piggy. It will, but no, it's not going to stay. So it's a, it is a finger ring. At least I've established that for you, even if I have faffed about. So I'll just <laughs> bend it back in again, because I, and pop it back on my finger, and there we go. I also really like thumb rings. That's one of my favourite things, is a thumb ring. Um, I went through a phase, I used to always wear a thumb ring, and I kept losing them because i do gardening and things like that and you know you, you're putting your hands in the soil you're pushing the plants down about an hour later i'd be like where's my ring fortunately they were never expensive ones they were always fun ones you know just silver but um it got really frustrating so i stopped wearing them but you see on the thumb i really like a thumb ring getting on to the rest of the jewelry gosh this is gonna be one of those videos I seem to do a lot of those at the moment. I thought I'd get more professional as time went on, but I think I'm becoming more laid back. <laughs> so then inside are the two other pieces. And as usual, they have the Mint Mongoose, uh, spend 40 pounds, get something for free, get a box for free. And I think it's earrings and a necklace. So let's open them up and have a look. This box never disappoints never i really like mint mongoose it never disappoints me it's always lovely it's always well curated and thought out and and different which i really like here we go here come the earrings oh oh they're lovely oh i'm sorry but those are just lovely wait till you see these i know i'm raving about them and not showing you am i but i'm just making sure i've got the bits not losing anything look at that again let me get the black I put that whoa <laughs> they are gold again they're the shepherd's crook but can you see the design i hope you can see the design. yes there it is i can see it's just come into focus that is really lovely it's like i mean it's probably acrylic 
but it looks almost like marble you know it's white with these black lines through it oh i i like very much they've come with um what i was messing with which are the little plastic safety clips that you can put on the back i won't bother with those but i will pop the earrings in so you can see the two of them so there we go that's them in i'm never disappointed with my mongoose never disappointed and then this must be the necklace not that it says that it's a necklace i'm just guessing that it's a necklace because i can see a chain in there and i don't think it would be a bracelet and earrings i think it's more likely to be a necklace and earrings let's have a look oh yes and it's the same effect which you might be able to see better than with the earrings let me just show you can you see that with the black on the white it's gold some people have silver some people far prefer silver jewelry and you can tell them whether you want gold or silver or whether you just don't care i prefer gold i think it's to do with my skin tone i have a lot of white gold jewelry and i've got a lot of silver jewelry it never looks quite as well on me so um I'm just gonna pop this on again it's got stations uh one two three four stations on it um i like this a lot this is very me very very me um oh missed it oops let's get myself adjusted and there we go i actually don't have a necklace on today i don't know why i didn't put one on this morning but there we go isn't that lovely oh well I'm happy with everything today you know I, I don't know whether it's because it's mother's day and everyone's being nice or whether genuinely i just think everything i've had so far today has been lovely i love the ring which i think will be staying a thumb ring in this house i love love these earrings with the necklace i just think that's great and the t-shirt well i think it's beaten the tea club by quite a quite a distance i really like that you know i love a black t-shirt anyway but i actually like the the slogan on it i like the sort of um what i say subtlety maybe of it it's not so you know it, it's got that sort of almost an organic sort of look for it beauty in the process so there we go that was um mint mongoose and bookishly and my second video of the day this is super efficient of me mind if i was really really efficient i'd have changed my hair and my makeup and put on a different outfit and i'd pretend it was a different day but i'm just <laughs> i'm me being me nick's upstairs starting to get prepped for work tomorrow um he has a little routine that he does every sunday night where he um lays things out and he, he makes sure he's got this and makes sure he's very organized he's not like me i'm about to go and sit at my desk do this week's um, bullet journal ready and try and clear some of this out and onto the page so that I'm in control next week but until my paint comes I'm not in control am I anyway I keep saying that every video where's my paint where's my paint you can see that's really all that's on my mind at the moment so um yeah that was it that was those two things the earrings and necklace which is staying on with the ring oh don't sorry but Nethel are playing over by there and looking like they're going to knock everything off. The t-shirt, the book, the Mayor of Casterbridge, and some peppermint tea. So this is a win-win, 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 win-win-win. <laughs> okay, I'm off and, um, and I'll see you again real soon. Okay, bye guys.